So how long do you think it takes to make motion graphics like this? 30 minutes? An hour? Or even more? Well, surprise! Each one of these was made in under a minute. From the idea, to prompt, to the final animation, all in less than 60 seconds. As someone who edit videos and design motion graphics professionally, I have to admit, this tool kind of blows my mind. It just gets it. It understands what creator expect, how different editing style work, and even picks up on the tiny details that makes animation stand out. This isn't just fast, it's smart, and we are about to dive in to see exactly how it works. The tool's name is Hera. Just type hera.video and you'll get to this page. Then go up to start creating and sign in with your Google account. Once you're logged in, you can explore the whole Hera library. And you can also use pre-made templates here, which can be super handy. You can build your own templates too, which is super exciting, but as you see, I haven't built any till now. Let's say you want to use one of the pre-made templates. This one, for example. Click on Use this template. I will write Leave the icon and animation exactly the same. Just replace the letters to the name Lekush. Hit this button here and wait for a few seconds. It did a good job, but for my taste the letters are a little too big. So I will write again. Make the font a little smaller. And here it is, perfect Instagram icon animation. Now let's explore the main workspace a little bit. Here we have a text box, this is where you describe the animation you want. Think of it like a chat GPT, but for motion graphics. You can of course upload an image to use a visual inspiration, insert a video you like, here you can import audio, custom fonts, or even better, you can add your own vectors too. Just drag in your SVGs. At the top, you can tweak the aspect ratio from 16 by 9, vertical, square or portrait. Here you can choose animation length, anything from 5 up to 60 seconds. Alright, let's put Hera to the test. Because I'm an NBA fan, I will write Create sports highlight animation of NBA all-time scorers. This is what we get. Pretty cool animation. But I would like to add players pictures, so I will add this to the text and run it one more time. As you can see, it didn't find Karim's and Carl's picture, but you can see how this works. If you want to export the animation, you just have to go up here and click export. And because I'm a pro user, I can also choose to export the file in 1080p or 4K. But if you are on a basic plan, you can export it in 720p, which I find totally enough for the animations. All the rest you can leave as it is and hit export. But if you would like to upgrade to a pro version, click the link below to get 15% off through my referral link. There's one more thing I would like to show you. If you would like to resize some parts, you just have to highlight it and drag those handles here. And if you want to change the background, for example, just go to this icon and choose the color you need. So simple. Same is with the text. Highlight it, go to color icon and pick the color. Let's create our second animation. 
we will jump into crypto world now. So I will write create a graph animation of Bitcoin value from 2019 till this day. That is pretty awesome. The only thing I discover is that it's pulling the data up to year 2024. So the Bitcoin value shown here isn't accurate, but the graph animation looks really cool to me. I will create one more animation and this time with icons. I find those that I really like and I'm going to take them as a reference. I will write this prompt. Create animation of simple modern icons on the black background. Icons should be white and with blue neon shadow behind. Icons should appear from the bottom to the center in this order. Cell phone, tablet, laptop, headphones. Let's change the duration or let's leave it at 5 seconds. Here they are, looking good, but I would like to have them horizontally and not vertically. So I will change that. Position the icons horizontally. Yes, this is so much better. The only thing I will change is size of the icons. And like I said earlier, we can resize them by highlighting them and change the size on each icon. And here is our end result. No matter what kind of graphic animation you need for your presentations, Hera will do it for you. And here's the best part, it will save you a lot of editing time. So I hope you find this tutorial useful. Don't forget to like and subscribe so you don't miss the next one. Take care and see you soon.